It's not the Grinch who stole Christmas at all. It's jerks like this. We start in Crimea. Oh, we got this beautiful Christmas tree. And that's when this fellow walks up, puts his hood on, and he's like, I'll be taking this one. Don't, don't people realize that the identifying part of their head is in the front, not the back? <laughs> But if he puts the hoodie on, Nick, it's like an invisibility cloak. No one can see him anymore. Well, there's always cameras watching, and they saw him, and they were able to identify this 20-year-old man. Here we have him standing in police custody with the <laughs> ornaments that he stole in tow. He looks so dumb. The Russian police are brilliant at public shaming. They're like, uh, oh, yeah, yeah, stand right here in front uh -huh. of the camera. No, 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 no. Yeah. Hold on to those Christmas ornaments. That'll look great up on our website. <laughs> he asked for forgiveness from the townspeople and the stolen Christmas tree ornaments were confiscated and returned to the Christmas tree. All right, well, these next fellas, they're also up to no good. People put a lot of time and effort into these displays and they're now throwing pieces of the display around. They take off and when they turn, oh, wow. what is that That's now? Bad. It looks like it was also a part of the display. Now they go through all of this trouble to flip this sled out into the parking lot. You can see that it was a part of the display. Police are investigating and looking for them. Something tells me that when they do get caught, the Christmas spirit, well, it's not gonna exist anymore. <laughs>